Good afternoon, guys. Corey Frazier here, Cass Auto Sales, hashtag Frazier's Friends. Uh, today, I'm just going to do a quick uh, lot walk on uh, inventory that's coming in. Uh, still needs to go through detail in the shop, uh, but I just want to get that out there for everyone here. We got a 2014 Long Bed 2500 SLT67 Cummins. I believe this is a, a diesel anyway. Let's take a look. Nope, this is a gasser. 2,500 gasser, 96,000 miles. Sorry guys, assumed it was a diesel <laughs> considering. So what we deal in mostly is diesel, but occasionally we get those in. A 16 WRX, uh, 48,000 miles on it. Uh, dirty, still needs to go through detail, but uh, just in, and get some uh, inside details, clean as can be, wow, that's nice, uh, 40, 48,000 miles on this one, media center, six speed heated seats, sunroof, I mean, the interior looks really really good little spot here go ahead and detail that up come and clean let me get the other side here for you let's see straight as an arrow tires look good on this thing great actually uh, get back to this 14 long bed so people can see the other side there I don't have pricing on these yet this one I do it's a 2010 67 um, rather bit of a unicorn type of truck and what I mean by that this is pre admissions last year before the DPF DEF uh, DEF was introduced in 2013 the DPF was introduced in 2011 so 2011 2012 they have the DPF but not the DEF this one is pre admissions completely and first year the high output so it's what makes this one pretty popular uh, low miles Tires are in pretty good condition. Uh, let's get this out. I know it needs some, a little bit of leather body straight, no major dents, dings, no huge scratches. <laughs> Bed liner. And then in the interior here, uh, they're gonna have to do a little bit of seat work on the driver's side, a little bit of wear coming in and out, but that's uh, a half a day for the vendor to come in. And repair so six six seater three in the front three in the back open this guy up here the manufacturer sticker here you can pause the video screenshot and zoom in on what you need there uh, yeah so this one does have the cargo containers both sides rear air definitely not a smoker uh, and this is definitely a U.S. truck, which is huge. And then we got a 2015 Land Rover LR4. I cannot say I'm terribly familiar with these. We can talk diesel truck all day long. And when getting these high-end Europeans, not the most knowledgeable, I must admit. I'll be the first to admit. But I can always research the information and get it to you. Oh, three sunroofs. Nice. Back here, mind you guys, this is pre-detail, pre-everything. So, the product's going to look a whole lot different after uh, detail. I love the before and afters. Uh, let's open this guy up here. I'm not sure if this is a third row. Let's take a look. Oh, yep. So there's three seats, third row on this. Plenty of cargo mats. Holy smokes. Shot from the back. This one's straight too. This one's really straight as well. Well, guys, I mean, hopefully this helps answer some questions. Uh, these are just a few of the new inventory. I really wanted to get that 2010 in here. Uh, this one's super popular. Here, let me just go ahead and turn it over for, for the folks. Uh, wait for that glow plug. 
broom. So good news. No check engine lights or anything on this guy. So aftermarket Bluetooth stereo, which is which is good. I wonder if this one has Navi. No, but Bluetooth, which is important. And then for the power rear slider up here, this was definitely a non-smoker truck. That's for sure. Yeah, that one's gonna go fast, uh, fast. I bet you anything that's sold before it even gets through the service center. And there's a 7.3 dump truck, manual. Service, what are you guys up to back here today? A lazy day. And then we got a long bed 356.7 right there. Well, guys, again, hopefully this helps answer some questions. How about a Mac Daddy 2020 AT4 GMC long bed? Yeah, that's a popular one. Well, guys, uh, hopefully it helped answer some questions. Um, reach out, give me a call or a text if you're interested in any of these here. The 16 WRX. The long bed, gasser, 2500 Dodge, or I should say Ram, 2010 6.7 high output Ram. Um, that one's a popular one, and of course the 15 LR4. Just reach out if you, uh, you have questions on uh, pricing, when they're going to be done. I imagine this one doesn't have a whole lot that needs to be done to it. That one should get through pretty quick. I'm sure that one's going in for certification too, as a certified pre-owned. Um, yeah, guys, reach out if you have any questions. Uh, my contact information is in the description below. Happy to uh, get you any video walk-arounds. Um, links for instant quotes if you're on the island, in, on the islands in Hawaii, up in Alaska, or nationwide, and get you that. Um, I do want to say thank you for your time and consideration, and hopefully I can earn your business. We'll see you next time, guys.